Hi, I'm Matthew. Welcome to my channel, and today it's Will It Shave Wednesday. It is Will It Shave Wednesday, and unfortunately, no shave today, but this video is a quick tip, trick, hack, or DIY whatever you want to call it. I'm going to try to make it a short video. So you guys know that I like to use ice as a post shave routine. And I feel like this is an excellent tip or trick for people that cannot get along with menthol. And so I've experimented along the years on what is the best way to use ice. Uh, I used to get just the little ice cubes and try to, you know, and it would become messy. And then you're trying to get another bowl and you know blah 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 so uh what i've came up with is this okay so uh i'm cheap frugal whatever you want to call it uh i like to repurpose things and though this is not my favorite deodorant i do use it just when i'm needing the container <laughs> all right so uh, the thing about this container is it has a twist off lid you can pick this up or i pick it up at walmart for a dollar 97 and it's kind of hidden it's always on the bottom shelf and there's just one width of these between a bunch of other things so it's easy to overlook and they usually just have a couple now the reason i went with this because it has the screw on top and a push button on the bottom well it's not really a button it's like the old push-up stick back when you're a kid so what you will do is push this all the way out and this is why I'm mentioning it is because this bottom part here um, it creates a liquid tight seal so if you don't like the brute scent you can just pop this off or you can use it and then once it is consumed you're ready to go and I would I always wash it out and so this is what it, uh, I stripped the label off of it and there's always condensation building up on it. But whenever you go to um, use it, just make sure the bottom is pushed all the way down. And whenever you first get it out of the freezer, it's not going to push up right away. But during the shave, it gives it just enough time to melt ever so slightly the water around it and it will create a jacket. So I'll always kind of do that off camera. Sometimes you'll see it. But uh, yeah, this is what it looks like. You'll push it up and it's ice. This one is getting near to the bottom. Um, and I've not had any issues. If you wanna refill this every time, you can. You just put more water, screw the lid on, stick it in the freezer, boom. Okay, now, uh, you know, some people mistaken this, and I always try to say ice cube or ice tube. And if you're not really listening, but just watching, this could be mistaken as an alum block. But you know the drill, you just put it on wherever, you know, you have the irritation, just like an alum block. And man, it feels nice. It's really nice. Um, it The first couple times you use it, it's a little bit of a shocker. So when I first started out, I was using ice cubes and they were messy. So I went with the bigger ice cubes and they are very nice to apply to the face, a little bit more difficult to hold. And as they wear down, they become messier and all this stuff. And sometimes they get confused with the PAA cube and you can see why. So if you want to go that option, uh, I just went on Amazon and for, I didn't purchase this for making these, but I had these for, uh, drinking bourbon and whiskey and they just go nicely into a cup you can get this i don't remember how much it was eight to ten bucks or something and so when i graduated away from that i was using this and then i would say ice tube and i just love that feeling but then i realized there's another paa item called ice tube so it's uh not appreciative it's just ice water in a container frozen either one of these options will work great if you use or try to use like a gel container you'll find out quickly that the bottom tray 
uh, has holes in it, just like some of the other non-round items. So what you're looking for is the bottom that pushes the deodorant up. You want it to be solid, because if you try to put water in the other ones, it's just gonna run out at the bottom. So there's my quick little tip, trick, hack, suggestion. It works great for me. Let me know, have you tried ice as part of your post shave routine and how does it work? Let me know in the comments below and I will see you guys on Sunday Shave.